Tell me! Stop it! Who have you been talking to? He doesn't know what you're talking about. You'd better start talking. Please, stop this! Who is Khrushchev's lapdog? How can you do this to him? I know you gave the data to someone. Never do that. You! <laughs> I guess he's dead. <laughs> Now then, I hope you'll prove more entertaining than he was. But first, let's take a look at your body, shall we? Hmm. You've certainly seen your share of battles. <laughs> Consider yourself lucky. I am about to show you what hell is really like. Well then, let's get started. What is your target? Is it the Shagohad? Or Sokolov? Or maybe it's the Legacy? Answer me! Who is helping you? Who let you in here? You're a tough one, but even you must have your limits. And I am a patient man. Here's where the fun really begins. Body carries an electric charge of 10 million volts. Let's see how you like this. Now answer me. How much does the CIA know? They're after my legacy. Aren't they? Your real target is the Philosopher's Legacy, isn't it? Yes, yes. Let yourself go. That's what I want to see. It's no use. He's not going to talk. He's been trained not to break. Trained by me. <sighs> Admit it! We're after the location of the Legacy! The secret fund established by the three great powers during the two world wars. That's what you're looking for, isn't it? One hundred billion dollars, divided up and hidden all over the world. And you're looking for a record of where all that money is hidden, right? No matter. The Philosopher's Legacy is safely in my possession, in the underground vault of Groznikrat. You'll never live. What's this? A transmitter? 
Who's responsible for this? I am. I planted it on him to keep track of his movements. Why? So the Cobras could ambush him. If they knew where he was gonna be, they wouldn't have gotten themselves slaughtered. It pains me to do this, boss, but under the circumstances... I'm afraid I must ask you to show me some proof that you and he were not in collusion. You don't trust me, is that it? Not that. But he is your apprentice. What do you want me to do? Let's see. Cut out his eyes. I don't like those blue eyes of his. There's nothing more important to a soldier than his eyes. You made him a soldier, and now you will unmake him. Yes, it'll make for a touching display. He's all yours. Do it! Ruin him! Just as he did the Cobras! What is it, Tanya? He suffered enough. Well, well. Why are you protecting him? That smell. Tatiana! You're the spy! What are you talking about? I know that smell. Stop it! Taking a fancy to her, eh, Ocelot? No. I have no interest in this woman. I want to test her. I'll let this be the judge. Do as you like. Go. Satisfied now? <laughs> well, that was refreshing. Come, we're going to my room. So you survived the Colonel's torture, eh? Watching this has made me realize something. <laughs> it's really not that bad. It's the ultimate form of expression. <laughs> You got lucky this time, Tatiana.
Run! I've prepared an escape route for us. Go out and head west. Pass underneath the connecting passageway and go north. You'll find an open manhole there. You're... Quiet! Go through the manhole down into the sewers. The door at the north end of the sewers is unlocked. You can use it to get outside the fortress. I've got your equipment. We'll meet up later. Eva. But I can't get too close to your cell. You'll have to figure a way out of there yourself. I'll be in touch. I've been waiting for this. Nobody interfere. Oh. 
coast of sorrows. And you are one of them. I am the sorrow. Like you, I too am filled with sadness. This world is one of sadness. Battle brings death. Death brings sorrow. The living may not hear them. Their voices may fall upon deaf ears. But make no mistake. The dead are not silent. Now you will know the sorrow of those whose lives you have ended. Nice to meet you, Snake. I'm Tatiana. Here's your equipment. Eva, you could use a towel. So could you. <laughs> <laughs> 